Hey everybody, Good Time Adam coming at you with a quick video. Uh, this is going to be part one in a two part series. It was going to be one video, but I'm a degenerate and I opened the, the other blaster off the video. So it's going to be a two part series because I'm waiting for my 2022 blaster to come in. But uh, I just want to do a comparison. want to see what last year's blaster was like compared to one this year of course it's going to be a small sample size because it's only going to be two one of each but i just want to see what it's see what we get here a little experiment we'll say so we're going to do the 2021 and then as soon as my 2022 gets here we'll film that and we'll do the comparison uh you know we'll count how many of everything we've got here and compare it to the other one it's the same amount of cards i believe so there should be no difference there the only difference should be in the quality of the packs and with the higher print runs this year this year chances are we're gonna have better last year packs bob shet trevor bauer solaire I'm not going to check rookie cards or anything. We're just going to simply compare how many Bowman firsts and how many first crumbs we get. And there's an Austin Martin paper. Got some color coming up. A Dax Fulton out of 150. 87 out of 150. So, and a Jonathan India. So right now we're at one chrome Bowman first, one paper Bowman first, and one blue parallel numbered out of 150. And that has no color to it whatsoever. Or has color to it, but not chrome. Jimenez. Again, these are good rookies. I'm not ignoring them before this video. We're just looking to compare how many Bowman first, how many Crohn's we're getting. There's Brandon Marsh. He's playing pretty good this year. De La Rosa. That's a first. Bobby Miller. Now, it's going to be tough comparison too because, you know, this 2021 was coming off COVID and stuff. There was COVID, you know, this year, there are a lot more firsts because there was a minor league season. So magical. And look at this. Hit an auto. Chrome Bowman first. Jario Palmeres. And I have hit his rated prospect card, too. Uh, so that's awesome. Hit an auto. Hopefully, out of ne out of 2022, we will hit an auto as well. I had a lot of luck on these 2021s. Not going to lie. I hit a Julio Rodriguez auto that I sold for a terrible... I made a terrible deal, but it was right when I got back into collecting. So I claim ignorance, but it was stupid. I traded for like an Andrew McCutcheon uh, graded card that was a 10. Not a rookie. Jake Vogel first. Tyler Freeman. Daniel Lynch. Shay Langoliers. And Baron Laura. We're down to two packs so far. This blaster has been pretty solid, I would say. Not a heck of a lot of firsts. So I do think that this year's, I think the 2022 is going to have more first in it. Will it have more color? That I don't know. You know, we hit an auto out of 99 so far. And a paper first out of, or not a paper first, but a paper prospect out of 150. So I don't know if we'll have that much luck with color in the new one but i do think that we will have way more first so this is the last pack i'd say hoping for last pack magic but we've had a heck of a few packs here 
Howard, Marte, Joey Votto, Keston here, uh, Boster. There's a Julio Rod, J Rod, right there in the old Bowman style. That's a great card. Really like it. Uh, Jordan, Nick Lodolo, numbered out of 499. Not a first, but that's a numbered chrome. I'll put that there. Um, Soderstrom, Bryce Terang, and Pagaro. So, let's take a count. Chrome first. We got one, two, an awesome one, three, and four. And paper first. We're looking at Jeremy De La Rosa and Austin Martin. Just two. So, well, as soon as I get my 2022 in, here's the colored uh, prospects. We got Nick Lidolo, 499 Chrome, and Dax Fulton out of 150 uh, As soon as I get to 2022, we're going to open that, compare it. I'll have my notes to make sure we know what we hit in this one for a reminder, and we'll see what happens. Hopefully, everybody, you'll like, share the video. If you're not, subscribe to the channel. Hit the little bell for a reminder so you know when I put up a new video, a new rip. Check it out. And uh, as always, folks, have a good time and have a good night. <laughs>